The Pratt and Whitney R2800 Double Wasp was a two-row, 18-cylinder, air-cooled radial engine. It was first ready for operational use in 1939. The Double Wasp was one of the most powerful engines made for its day in terms of power to weight ratio. In addition, it was a rugged, reliable, and easy to maintain engine that was also economical to operate. The result was it was very popular with aircraft designers. It was an engine that would be used in about three dozen different aircraft manufactured in the 1940s and the 1950s. It was used in two of the most famous American fighter planes of World War II, the P-47 Thunderbolt and the Navy's F-4U Corsair. It was also used in the less popularly known Navy Hellcat fighter. The Hellcat was the Navy fighter that shot down the most Japanese aircraft. In World War II, the Double Wasp was also used in multi-engine aircraft, such as the Douglas A-26 Invader and the Martin B-26 Marauder medium bombers, and the C-46 Commando cargo airplane. It was also used in the twin-engine Northrop P-61 Black Widow night fighter. After World War II, the Double Wasp continued to be used in numerous aircraft. One example was the Douglas DC-6 four-engine passenger liner, manufactured from 1947 to 1958. The military version of the DC-6 was the C-118. In the 1950s, the Double Wasp was even used in a helicopter. This was the Sikorsky CH-37 Mojave. This entered service with the U.S. Marines in 1956. This was the largest helicopter in the world in the 1950s. It was powered by two Double Wasp engines. The production of the Double Wasp stopped in 1960. By then, over 125,000 engines had been made. This was one of the largest production runs of any aircraft engine. Some of the various aircraft using double wasp engines continue to be flown in America and around the world way into the 21st century. Specifications of the R2800 double wasp engine were it was an 18-cylinder radial engine in two rows with nine cylinders each. It was air-cooled. It used water injection and a supercharger. It had a displacement of 2,804 inches with a bore of 5.75 inches and a stroke of 6 inches. It used 100 to 130 octane gasoline. The engine weighed 2,360 pounds. The power output was 2,400 horsepower at 2,700 RPM. The power to weight ratio was 0.89 horsepower per pound, or said differently, one horsepower per cubic inch.